Hello everybody, welcome back to another Fashion 5 Tactica video! Last time we started our journey, we ended up in this random kingdom place. Our friends got enslaved by some, I don't know, seductress? I, I don't bloody know. Um, and then we met the, this one person saved us, uh, uh, Arena. And then we took us back to the secret hideout, which is just LeBlanc! What? What? So we're going to talk to her, right now. The dire state of things. Loading, loading. So you and your friends are from another world? I have to admit, that's rather hard to grasp. This world's the only one I've ever known. On top of that, you're also telling me you're thieves who steal hearts. And you just stumbled into this world? <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. Same. Believe me, we're in the same boat here. All of a sudden, we were surrounded by Marie's forces, and you had to rescue us. We really have no idea what's going on. Well, we can try to hash it out later. Uh, Morgana, and you. I suppose it's my turn to answer questions. Feel free to ask away. Okay. She's a ruthless tyrant who fancies herself the ruler of these parts. This used to be a peaceful place, free of any sort of conflict. Then, Marie appeared, and everything changed. She declared that the entire city and all its citizens were now her property. With her invincible soldiers leading the way, she quickly seized full control. Invincible soldiers? You mean, those guys who attacked us? Yes. We've taken to calling them legionnaires. What does the memo say? Legionnaires, hostile monstrosities found only within kingdoms. They are believed to be born from the minds of twisted individuals attacking whoever their designated ruler demands. I'm sure you saw for yourselves. Not only are they incredibly strong, but all we can do is knock them out. They're always back on their feet all too soon. No matter the tactics we try, they're seemingly invincible. Eek. Maybe they're shadows of some kind. Only personas can put down a shadow. No wonder you didn't stand a chance. Shadows? Personas? Whatever those may be, I knew you had solid intel on the enemy. Anyway, after Marie showed up and declared that this was her kingdom, now she brainwashes anyone she can find, then uses them up until they're nothing. Anything else you'd like to ask? Uh... Yeah. yeah, she said this was the Rebel Corps' hideout, didn't she? Marie is strong enough that it'll take everyone in the city to stop her. That's why I founded the Rebel Corps. I've served as leader ever since. As the one who inspired the citizens here to fight, it's my job to see that Marie no longer enslaves them. Well, you certainly have a good reason to be considered a criminal, huh? Pretty impressive, Arena. <laughs> well, our current win record certainly isn't impressive. There are so few of us left now. We're basically an army in name only. Yeah, when your enemies get right back up, there's only so much you can do. Right. The best we can do now is lay low here and look for gaps in their defense. So, was there anything else? Why did you rescue Why? us? You two were in trouble, so I had to help. Even if it meant getting caught? Those guys already had it out for you. True. And I admit, I was already considering recruiting you to our cause. I'd never seen anyone go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Marie's forces before. Not that well, anyway. We'll certainly take the compliment. I but agree. you were the real star back there. Thanks again. Morgana, stop flirting! It was a pretty big gamble on my part, but I'm definitely glad it paid off. So, anything else? So, I understand that Marie is doing whatever she pleases in this world. But, do you know if she has a goal? If she's going through the effort of enslaving everyone, it has to be for some reason. <sighs> the perfect wedding. The perfect wedding? She wants to get married? Yes, Marie is in a perpetual state of preparing her wedding. 
What? It's become our single obsession by this point. It always needs to be more, no matter the pain it may cause. Can't say I expected that. Her own legionnaires, the citizens she captured, even your own friends are all forced to prepare her wedding. What? She was even able to command them to build her that tank with the premature message on the grill. Marie sends oh, a real threat. Okay. She's self-centered enough to sacrifice everyone around her for her own desires. And if she's as powerful as she seems, then everyone's in real trouble. Oh, we need to act fast. We do. Well, now that we've we got do a indeed. Base, I do have to agree. Let's figure out our next course of action. That would definitely do the most good, but there are still too many unknowns. So long as Marie still has the others under her control, they're basically her hostages. About that, I have a suggestion. You two want to free your friends from Marie and escape this metaverse. And I want to take Marie down so nobody has to live under a tyrant anymore. With that in mind, I think we should join forces. Oh, I have to agree. Would you be willing to join the Rebel Corps if I were to help you on your rescue mission? <laughs> I see. You want to make a deal, right? How about it? Especially when you consider how there's no way to rescue the others without facing down Marie. Not only do we need to rescue our friends, but we need to figure out how to get back home, too. That's a good point. I'd say the more of us, the better. And she seems pretty capable, too. We talked it over, and it's unanimous. You've got a deal, Arena. Excellent. Then it's a deal. <laughs> I'm looking forward to this. First things first. I officially deem you two members of the Rebel Corps. So, with that said... Welcome to the resistance, comrades. Wow. The comrades? Uh, well, uh... Look at us. The leader of the Phantom Thieves, codenamed Joker, a second year student of Shuden Academy. He and the other thieves purge distorted the sides from the hearts of ill doers. Possessing the wild card affinity allows him to use multiple personas. The trickster moniker was given to him because of his uncanny knack for altering fate. Morgana, a mysterious entity with a resemblance of a cat, codenamed Mona, as an expert in the art of fiefdom. He taught a group the tricks of their trades. His peculiar origin once troubled him deeply, but he's since become comfortable in his own fur as a member of the Phantom McFeast. Just so long as no one calls him a cat. Is there someone else? Oh, we never did Arena. The leader of the Rebel Corps who forges and lights the Phantom Thieves to achieve a mutual goal. The sight of Arena brandishing her spear, uh, oh, brandishing her spear as she races across the battlefield inspires courage in those who follow her. Through glimpses of childness, childness, childishness can be gleaned beneath her gallantry. Places hide out the base of the operations for the both Hand of Feet and the Rebel Corps in the part of the metaverse that many of us have currently found themselves. Their hideout is a spitting image of the real world LeBlanc, yet no one knows why. Having a private relaxed atmosphere helps them feel at ease here. Oh, I still have to say, it's Yongin with Yaha, town of retro field despite being in Tokyo, commonly known as Yonja. Many restaurants in line in the back alleys and modest movie theatres, public baths and batting centres, providing some of the small scale recreation. LeBlanc, Ren's temporary residence and home of the Phantom Thieves can be found here, along with Futaba and Sojiro's house. Shuden Academy, the private high school attended by Jogo and the most other Phantom Thieves, is also where the first change of heart incident took place. The school has been mired in controversies, including the faculty instigated assault of various scandals and the principal's death. It seems that things have finally settled down, though. For now. Oh, God. <clears throat> Phantom Feet, a group of feet who infiltrate the minds of the corrupt and steal their hearts to make them change their ways. They kicked off a quest to save the world with their first change of heart. The true identities of these heroes are known only to a select few accomplices. Phantom Feet for Tyre. The outfits worn by the Phantom Thieves are allowed to hide their true identities. In most cases, they find themselves in the outfits automatically the moment they enter the metaverse. Many of the codenames used by the Phantom Thieves were inspired by their attire as it represents some aspects of their true self. Codenames An alias used to conceal the identity of a Phantom Thief while in the metaverse. Some are based on a member's mask or outfits, while others are inspired by a personality. According to the self contained expert Phantom Thief, then using one's real name is considered uncool. Persona a unique power wielded by a phantom thieves, each one's physical form and 
capacity, capabilities influenced by the individual user's hearts as an inseparable part of one's identity. It also serves as a form of personal protection with this power. The Phantom Thieves fight for their convictions and strive to change the world. In a world. And shadows, fantastical beings found within palaces and mementos. Most take the appearance of gods and demons from human law. Some meet will even lend Joker their aid, depending on his tact in negotiations. Right. Yeah, I guess we'll just go with that for That's now. That's everything. Two GP. Huh? What's GP? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Well, I'm going to save, because I actually am getting to save. Okay. You can prep. Because you've got skills. I'm going to assume that's what the GP is for. Wait. Okay. A hole. Acquire a skill by pressing the cursor of the skill you desire. Pressing A, you can undo this by pressing A again, which will be fun to do. Okay. We can do our mission, commence operation. This will progress the story. I don't care. That's the whole point. We spent 12 minutes already. Jesus Christ. Boom. Hey, what's with him? Hey, Jen, who's this unfamiliar furball? to have at anyone. You can stand down. These are our new comrades. I don't even want to get into it. Just fill him in on our situation later, Alina. You were out on recon, right? Find anything? Despite being brainwashed, her more powerful puppets usually get locked up for long years. We won't know for certain whether or not these are your friends unless we see for ourselves. Let's go find right. out. Right. Time for me to start upholding my end of the deal. If we really did find your friends, they could give our forces a solid boost when we spring them. I agree. All right. We'll head out. I'll draw up a plan of attack. It won't take very long. Oh. Um, yes, I agree. Expect us to get beat as badly as we did. What was that? That, that just looks so weird. Our power's not working like usual really held us back there. Maybe the metaverse just works differently here? Well, no use thinking about it now. Plus, we've got Arena helping us out with that now. Hopefully, she comes up with a strategy. Somehow, let's go through it. She might be able to tell us what's going on. At the very least, she'll have our backs. Okay, open hideout room. The V room. 
can only mean one thing. Oh my god. Whoa. It looks totally different in here now. Whoa. There are a bunch of machines all over the place. What happened? It's been a while. <laughs> well, a very short while, I suppose. Welcome to the Velvet Room. This realm exists between dream and reality. Between mind and... It appears you've suffered quite the ordeal. Miss Lavenza. Uh, this place has been affected by the same guidance of fate as that which has claimed yourselves. And this guiding hand... Oh boy, more memos! Lavenza. Arrived in the velvet room, who takes the form of a young girl? She refers to Ren as trickster, putting her un unequivocal trust in him as her benefactor while assisting or watching over his exploits. She is mostly polite and diligent in her duties, but tends to make the occasional head scratching marauder. And the velvet room. A mysterious blue room that lies on the border of dreams and reality between mind and matter. Lavenza is one of its residents, performing persona fusions for Renda. The room's appearance reflects its visitor's state of mind. In the past, it resembled a prison, but in the current metaverse, it, was its, it instead resembles a foundry. Did by a being with significant power. However, I do not know which being is responsible, nor. All I can say for certain is that our current situation deviates greatly from the natural course of events. I admit that my carelessness led to being caught in this aberration and pulled from my master's side. Oh, it got you too, Miss Lavenza? Whoever this being may be, they are also responsible for the chaotic state of this room. It's as if some force of negation has infected this place. This force has unfortunately affected you all as well, deepening the issue you currently face. I see. So that's why we couldn't summon our personas like usual. This woman named Marie called the place a kingdom or something. Whatever it is, it sure is weird. Then I will henceforth refer to that realm as a kingdom. This kingdom is a work palace and mementos locations within the metaverse created by the hearts of those who've been consumed by deadly sin these palaces these places materialize objects of the created design many of which are surreal like figments of a dream the phantom feet have determined that the area of the metaverse they currently stumbled in is not a palace an entire cognitive world discovered while the fantasies were in the real world Tokyo. If palaces are cognitive worlds built from the sort of distorted desires of individuals, Mentos is the best described place of the palace of the masses. Yaudaboa, the god of control, once attempted to drive humanity to ruin by exploiting this realm, but the Phantom Thieves managed to st st stimmy, stymie its self-centered prop. Disparate from Mementos and the other palaces. Unfortunately, returning will be no easy feat. We would each be stuck here for eternity were we to simply wait. Right. We've never given up before. We're not starting now. We're gonna rescue the others and get us all the hell out of here. I expected as much from you. This realm, sealed off from all other realities, there is still much to learn. However, so long as you have the will to overcome this ordeal, I will spare no effort to aid you. I am the one who rules over power. To draw out the potential lying dormant within you, I shall reprise my role for you in this place. As I had previously explained, this room has suffered from a grave disturbance. Apologies, but would you mind taking your leave? 
I vow to tidy up the place before your next return. Indeed, I fully believe that you can do this, Trickster. Trickster. Morgana, I leave him in your care. And I'll be sure not to let you down, Miss Lavenza. By the way, that out. Is that also the mysterious being's fault? No. I merely thought, under the circumstance, I could perhaps dress more fittingly to theme. What do you think? Oh Does my god. Me? Does it suit me? <laughs> yeah! Uh, looking cool! Looking cool. <laughs> pleases me to hear that. Well then, please visit me anytime you need, through the door in the hideout. Yes. We shall meet again soon. Okay. What to do? I shot one ago. I've had my own strange master paid and asked for this to be delivered to you promptly. Hmm? Dear Bill, I'm sorry regarding your current situation. I believe you're all wondering how you, you may acquire additional weapons. However, the type of weapons you need are special ones that operate based on your cognit cognitive nature of your abilities. It is nearly impossible to get your hands on such weapons in the metaverse. Mm. Ah yes, ah, I go off look at it. And, oh god, Manahisa Iwa Iwi Iwa. A go off looking middle-aged man who runs the airshop airsoft shop, untouchable, in a back alley of Shibuya Central Street. He does for business. He does business with the Phantom Beast, but offering model guns and customization services. He has a tattoo of a gecko on his neck. And there are local rumors here that he was once a member of the Yakuza. <clears throat> However, if they do not exist, then all you must do is build them from scratch. For this, I have a proposition. I have to make and repair your weapons for you. I believe you have some called online shopping in your real world. I follow following a similar system, you can place an order with me and I shall deliver your goods to you. I'll be adding new products in due time, so please make use of this service. Okay, that's all. Which means... No sign off, huh? Hell mysterious. That last one wouldn't be... Hmm. Money, 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 money. Hmm. Uh. Right. Loading screen. Let's have a look at the shop. Belt the shop. Range weapons are available for purchase at the shop. The range of the stock will improve as you progress through the story. Make smart use of the shop to ensure your success in battle. I've got some new products available. Um, what would you like? Well, I'm assuming we've. Everything good? Yes. Thanks for your purchase. Yes. Um. Please take your time. You have a good. All right, here you go. Make sure you're well prepared. Oh wow. Best of luck out there. Nice. Okay. We got new weapons. Oh shit, I didn't see what the previous one said. Oh well the hundred user level was shared by everyone and it increases their HP SP, their melee attack powers it grows, I just bit my tongue. You can always raise it by replaying missions via the replay option found in the hideout menu. 
In the preps menu, you can view and equip various skills in the equipment. You can also choose the ranged weapon each unit will wield. Set off for battle only after. Oh, set off for battle only after thorough preparation. Start the next operation by selecting mission while in the hideout. The next battle prompt appears if the operation will involve combat. Once you start by you will not be able to return to the hideout, so always prepare well before moving out. Ahem. <clears throat> Uh, we could talk. Ooh. The citizens' appearances. Okay. Hmm. Mm. So both people in the rebel court. Not going to be able to infer that based on their appearance and behaviour, but it's not working like that here for some reason. Mm. What do we know is that they're not meant the same stuff you humans are. Hmm, that's very interesting. Uh, why, but why does the arena look like a normal person? So many questions we don't have the answers to yet. I apologise. Oh, another cup of coffee. All right. Wow. I'm counting on you. We received two GP. Okay, so it's good to keep talking to people then. Right, next battle. Here we go. It's already been 26 minutes. Jesus. How long is this going to be? Take a look at this map. Hmm. The whole city's surrounded by the castle's outer walls, huh? Yes, the hideout's marked here. We're in part of the city that's a fair distance from the castle. And here is the prison where they're holding your friend. How do you plan for us to get there? Well, we certainly can't just travel the streets. Security is tighter than ever. They've been after me for quite a while, but now they're looking for you two as well. So, I think the safest course of action is to make our way there along the top of the castle's outer wall. Yeah, we're definitely less likely to get surrounded that way. But this is so reckless! Just imagine what would happen were you to fall! Don't you worry about that. We're used to this sort of stuff. We don't call ourselves phantom thieves for nothing, right? Oh, good. Sounds like this strategy will play to your strengths. Yes. Hopefully we can find our friends and get them out of there before it's too late. Everyone, <laughs> hang on just a bit longer. I mean, you're not really... Do I guess they talk to our friends. Uh, but who knows? Loading screen. Well, have you found those rats for me? Not yet, ma'am. Oh, we have every last man hunting them down. I see. Then, every last man. This is absolutely pathetic. I want those three at my feet now. Yes, ma'am. I swear, how can they all be so useless? Just as the ceremony was falling into place, the vermin start crawling in through the walls. All I need is the perfect wedding, then everything I've ever wanted will finally be within my grasp. Well, who are you getting married to? Until that moment comes, anyone in my way is sure to regret it. Oh, playthings! I think I'm in the mood now to try out my new little toys. Wait, and and for oh, and Rich Fatalba, never seen that defiant oh, okay. brat who escaped. Joker, was it? You are to find him and bring him to me. I want him alive. Got it? Your wish is our command, great lady Laurier. Soon, I'll have that arrogant brat within my grip once more. And this time, I'll crush it. Oh, whoops. Okay, I didn't mean to skip that. Um, ha 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 ha. There you go. I did the laugh. Uh, it's probably more like. <laughs> <laughs> 
Anyway. All right. Looks like we made it to the top. Oh. Let's go! Oh, puddle, puddly stuff. Yes, puddles, puddles, puddles. Awards! Each stage on South Convention is like more grand. It's you awards. If you successfully complete, you can confirm ward conditions on the pre battle skin by pressing X. Stars are used to represent different reward conditions. Yellow star complete, grey star incomplete, extra bin star not possible to complete. You can also confirm more, more conditions by analysis. Attaining a ward will grant you increased experience and money. So try to complete them whenever possible. Okay, no in the past gets cured. Yeah, oh yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Clear them five turns. Ha! <laughs> Don't they know? Do they know who I am? Any unit that ends the turn on a neon yellow square will recover a moderate amount of HP. Make sure to use this to your advantage. to despair. Here I go. Okay. Attack. I don't, wait, where am I in range? Here. You're done. Nice, Joker. Enemy hit. Uh, oh wait, actually, wait, I can. All right. Let's do this. What to do here? And yeah. boom. <laughs> Yes. So the red light sorrow. Another enemy down. Uh, Get ready for the boy. Check nice. out my pack. Here I go. Nice. You're dead, my friend. Yes. 
thing. Very well. All right. Revenge of types. The first time these enemies are attacked, they perform a counter instead of being down. However, they are wholly defenseless after countering. Should you attack them again in the same turn, they will be down. Wait, so if I use... Damn it, I'm not in range. A hundred health. Get him! I won't miss. Is yes, is Great partisan. This will do a lot of damage. Taken out. Going nice. That's it. Boom. Two returns. Some call me the everlasting goat. It's also a good thing to know that they can do it over covers as well. Good. That should do it here. I've got to know. Just what the hell are those things? Plus, your powers aren't working like usual either, are they? Miss Lavenza didn't know what was going on either. That means we must have reached a really strange place. It seems you two are still feeling held back. I must say, you're certainly holding your own regardless. Persona, of course. How'd you get that, if you don't mind my asking? Personas are the power of the heart made manifest. You should be able to summon one too, if you try. Uh, really? Would you mind if I tried now? Hmm. <sighs> They catch us. Let's go. Persona! I don't know why I just did that. What was that? What was that, man? Honestly. Defeat enemies. Oh my Christ. A new move. You've been shot, my friend. with the fast forward. Right. Triple threat. Oh. Oh, oops. Okay, cool. So we, so we can't fast forward this. Oh, okay. Might as well just use it. You're dead. Yeah, forgot what to do because it's dead. Ouch, I didn't see what the win conditions were. Oh well. What to do here? Uh, there was a way you could check, wasn't there? But I don't remember what it was.
Kill it actually. Okay. Nice. Oh, you're kidding. Oops. No, Morgana. Oh, no, I didn't mean to pause. Oops. I meant to press that. Sorry, Morgana, about to get hit. Oh, never mind. Gold ear. Nice one. Did we get everything done? Let's go. Mysterious game. Mysterious game. Mysterious game. Oh, interesting. <laughs> That's all of them. Yes, looks like it. I'm sorry. Ready to go? Yes. So is this doing us another level? Prison. We made it. Huh? Shh. Legionnaires incoming. Hide. Hmm, interesting. Phew, looks like we're in the clear. Security's a lot tighter around here. You Phantom Thieves are in a whole different league. I could learn a thing or two from you. We try to find every advantage we can. Never take your opponent's head on unless you have to. And yes. consider that your first lesson in Phantom Thievery. But it looks like you're getting the hang of it pretty quickly. Right, Joker? Yes! Wait, that's a he! Oh shoot, I'm get oh no. <laughs> I'm honored, but I'm already more incoming. We need a few of them this time. Let's start the next one. Puddles. Damn, I'm getting cancelled. Oh, shoot. Oh, I didn't see what the... I 
interesting and when a party member ends their turn without attacking they become charged and hence in their abilities the special abilities that are enhanced differ for each unit for example when a arena is child oh wait there's a is she so why did it say he oh i'm so confused she can down targets that are hiding behind cover with her ranged weapon i'm not charging the skill tree So, uh, is there a way to find out? Oh, is this what it is? Details. When charge is activated, increases movement by... Okay, that's good. And... Joker... Foresight. When charge is activated, ranged attack increased by one square. Interesting. that you went for them, but... All right. Okay. Looks like there's still enemies around. We've got some distance between us. How about you? How do you want to take them? Mm, I understand. Leave it to me. Persona. Well, I mean, actually, no. How do I just use Garu? Get him! Perfect 
interesting. What to do here? Let's do it. Show me what you got. I'll give it my all. Yeah. I forgot what to do. Triple threat them from this, can't we? Hold on. That's got them both in it, right? Yes! Let's go! We'll skip this one though. They, uh, they can't, they don't deserve to see the light of day. Anyway, let's go! Nice! Enemy down. Ah. Hmm. It appears okay. this area is free of guards. Let's keep moving. Okay. Hmm. What's wrong? Everything seems to be going well enough, considering. It's just this place is guarded pretty well. So why haven't we heard any alarms yet? Yeah. At least it doesn't sound bad. No use worrying over it now. All we can do is keep going. I agree. We can't be much further than that. It's so quiet in here, it's creepy. In there. We've come to save you. Huh? Come to what? What? Wait, that's not. Who are you? That's what I was gonna ask. So you're telling me this man isn't a phantom thief? Joker, do you even recognize him? Oh. Well, in that case, just who did we free? Is he the president person? What? Mm -hmm. Who are you? I thought the others were being held here. But where have I seen this guy before? On TV? Oh, right! The politician that went missing! It's Kasukabe or something, right? Kasukabe. Um, yes? I am Toshiro Kasukabe. I'd like for someone to tell me that as well. I don't get it. Just what is happening here? Finding myself in this bizarre world with all those terrible monsters. Then I get rescued by a magician looking team with a bizarre cat mascot. Is there something wrong with me? When did I even get here? He's muttering to himself like a loon. But at least he doesn't seem brainwashed by Marie. Then let's see if we can help him. Maybe he has some useful intel for us. Well, we certainly can't just leave him here to rot. That's settled it. We're gonna help you escape this prison. I don't know who you people are, but I would definitely like to get out of here. I suggest we make our way out before those terrible girls come back. Terrible girls? Yes. They had been guarding this prison until very recently. I promise you, they are not to be trifled with. I suggest avoiding them. Is that gonna be like Har and Makoto, Arn and Futaba? Especially the girl with the whip and the brazen leather outfit. 
and she's the scariest one by far. Hmm. I have a feeling we know just who he's talking about. Oh my. Just where do you four think you're going? How many times do I have to remind you? You belong right here. Let this do this girl! Listen, you must not provoke her. If you do, she won't hold back. I'll just be quiet. They're both far too dangerous to fight. Don't speak to them. Just figure out how to get out of here and take me with you. Oh, quit babbling, you pathetic coward. Did you really not get the whining whipped out of you last time? Where she's talking. They must still be brainwashed by Maria. Brainwashed? How dare you equate my handiwork to something so common as cleaning? This is domination! From every corner of their Jesus. bodies to every sense in their bodies, I am the one in control! Relishing something as terrible as that? You're one rotten lady! Amusing words, coming from some low-life thieves who snuck into my secure facility. I'm glad you did. Now I can snatch up the rest of you, all in one fell swoop. What is going on? You already know them? No, don't bother answering that. Let's just get away, fast. How do I not get a say here? Get ready. We're going to make them come to their senses. Okay. Great. I mean, it's a bit weird having Futaba fight. I'm guessing this is a boss fight then. Defeat Panther. Uh, win condition, zone of party gets turned. Okay. Sounds. Hmm, these bombs. Flag's probably got something to do with how we win. But. Ah. Danger. Let's go. Really thought that was actually gonna uh, wait. To okay. Do. Well, I could just kind of. Boom. Now that they're down, I don't know if they actually still hit us. Well, they're gonna go though, so... That's all that matters. Boom. Okay, that's interesting how they backed all of themselves into a corner.
blow that up for safety purposes. Oh, nice. Necessarily have a lo whole load of health. Oh, what? That can't be. Joker. All right. Persona. Hmm. Wait, no, hold on. This technically should kill. Enemy turn. Oh, God, Joker's about to take a hit. Oh. Okay. Ouch. Oh, no. Oh. Probably because that firepower is you. Ah! Oh, wait, wait, no, 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 we don't want that. Well. That's not bad. And that's not gonna be bad either. Okay. Die! Oh. Hmm. get three things though. I think I might come back to it this and then redo it. God. Sorry to say. <laughs> Lay down your arms and surrender. We may be confined here, but at least we'll have our lives. If they take us to Marie, she'll put us under her control. But even if that's true, how do you expect this skirmish to play out? I don't care if it's brainwashing or domination. It's better than dying. Hey, it's Toshiro, right? definitely agree that things are looking good, but it's not over for us yet. What a bog. Even if we have to crawl our way to the end, we fight. When you refuse to stand up to injustice, you become complicit.
I'm so confused. What? What? What the? It's a flag. Is this? Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Thank you. You made this possible. shall drive our rebellion. It's time for action. The revolution is here. Wow. Where'd that flag come from? Wait, we'll come back to that. Panther! Oracle! Oh. Like that brought him back. We'll start guessing later. Right now, we have to focus on escaping. Yes. Right. I have no idea what's going on here, but I have to agree with the catfish. What's wrong with going with catfish? Real well, all right. I am not a catfish. <sighs> what well, well, are you? Oh, my my apologies. I didn't realize I was mistaken. Hmm. An eel? I'm not an eel either. With your eyes, just oh, pull it together and give us a hand with them. Yes. Ah, yes. Allow me. All right, let's move out. I agree. I'll look after these two while they recover. Would you mind leading us back to the hideout? Yes. Yes. Let's get out of here. You lead the way. Okay. Okay. I get it. Follow me. Okay. Arena has acquired the unique skill Flag of Freedom. Unique skills are special skills that vary between party members. You can use the skill in the battle once the voltage gauge is full. The voltage gauge raises whenever you attack or receive damage, and using a unique skill will expend it completely. Unique skills have been locked in the skill tree. Well, that's interesting. Interessant. We're back at the bottom. Leon and Futaba are resting upstairs. They'll be awake soon enough. Next on our plate, we've got a lot of catching up to do. Yes. First, let's start off with you. All right, Toshiro. And for your own sake, I hope you don't turn out to be our enemy. Well, hang on now. That certainly makes suspicious of me, but imagine how I feel. Firstly, what is this place? And who are you people? No, wait. Why is there a cafe in a place like this? And why did you suddenly change appearances when you stepped inside? Uh, maybe try just going with the flow here. This is far beyond the flow. <laughs> In the past half hour alone, I've witnessed ten incidents where the laws of physics were outright defied. True. Actually, it's eleven if you count the... Oh, that one was... <sighs> Sounds like a no. Guess we should start from the top. Agreed. Is this going to be a... Hmm. Um, this world is somehow separate from the rest. It's controlled by a woman named Mario. Yes. So you phantom thieves have teamed up with the rebel core here to end her tyranny. Yeah, you got it. Make sense now? How the hell could I get that? I know. This has to be a dream. Some mistake. 
brains. We're not stuck in a dream or experiment. Okay, it's time for you to answer our questions. Why did Marie have you locked up in her prison? Well, I was... I actually have no idea. Hmm. Don't give me that look. Huh. Okay, cool. I know what you're all thinking. But I'm telling the truth. I just woke up in this world, then those monsters locked me up. But you remember your name and everything, right? Yes. Well, my name... I know I'm a diet member, and a few other details here and there. But there are these huge sections Ooh. of my memory that are gone. Well, Toshiro Kashikabe, a young and upcoming politician, said to be nominated to Canada for the next Prime Minister after went missing in the real world. The Phantom Thief found him imprisoned in Marie's castle due to having lost a chunk of his memory. Is he can't recall how he came to this world. You heard him. What's your take? Seriously? Well, I guess there's no proof he's with Marie. We can't just toss him out on the street. That's right. So just get me out of here as soon as possible. I'm not so stupid as to ask for phantom thieves to place their trust in someone like myself. Hang on. You know we're the phantom thieves? After the mess you've made over the last year, how could I not? Especially your most recent fiasco. <laughs> I remember that all too well. Wow. Even Toshiro knows who you are? Maybe the phantom thieves really are a big deal. For better or worse, I'd have to agree. Breaking more laws than one can count. Sowing discord through all of society. You may have your contingent of fans fawning over you, but I have nothing but distaste for your style of mayhem. I can't believe you've been a gang of children this whole time. No! But regardless of the circumstances, I cannot condone children engaging in illegal activities to rail against what they perceive as unjust authority figures. You sound like the exact kind of politician we go after. <laughs> uh, apologies. Now is probably not the best time for this. I'm not sure how you'll react to this. But I'd like to make a proposition. Uh. You phantom thieves are cooperating with the Rebel Corps to find a way back to the real world, correct? That means we share the same goal. How about you let me join you in exchange for my aid? What are you going to offer? I don't really feel like arguing against it. What do you think, Arena? We've heard everything we need to hear. Now we just have to decide whether or not we believe him. Hmm. And I think I'm going to believe him. Oh, thank you. I, I greatly appreciate it. And if you wind up double-crossing us, then we'll just deal with you the same way we'd handle any other traitor. Quite the clever rebel, aren't you? Let's make it official. Welcome to the Rebel Corps, Toshiro. Happy to be aboard. My housekeeping skills should come in handy here. Oh, you were planning to just stick around here. Come on. I hope we can pull it off at least. Yeah, I know the two of us are definitely capable. I won't let We've spread. got this. So is this now gonna put us in the thing? It is! Alright, people. Gonna say jot that down. Boom. Okay, people, thank you for watching this episode of Persona 5 Tactica. Next time we shall talk to the group. Mainly because that's what it says, and I don't know what comes next. So I'll see you then. Goodbye.